What's going on, y'all? It's your girl, Queen T, and we clocking in back with another banger, y'all. I haven't recorded in a few days. However, we back. Um, when I be working, I don't be recording. Cause I work 12-hour shifts. When I get home, I be tired, okay? I work 5 to 5, 4.45 to 5, okay? Beside the point, today, y'all, I just got to talk about a title. I'm going to just take y'all along with me. Uh, and the stuff I gotta do for the day. Um, unfortunately, when I got my car back, there was something wrong with the. My little going crazy, of course, because he wants attention. Sorry, I'm trying to learn to not get too distracted by him while I'm recording. But uh, anyways, it was something wrong with my car when I got it back on the same side that they uh fixed. So I'm gonna take it back to the shop. I do, it's not nothing like absolutely crazy major, but it is something that can't be fixed. And if they did it, I want them to fix it, obviously. Uh, so besides that, um, I do I do have to go to pick up my little heart machine. Um, they trying to monitor my heart to make sure nothing is going wrong with it or whatever like that. So I do have to go by the hospital, by my cardiologist and go pick up the heart machine. I also need to go a little bit of grocery shopping because I'm about to get my wisdom teeth pulled tomorrow. So I want to make sure I have like soups and smoothies and stuff like that to hold me over while I'm not going to be eating. Um, I think that's pretty much it. If anything, y'all going to come with me so y'all going to see what else I do. But make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and y'all stay tuned for the rest of this video. We out. All right, y'all. So we headed out right now. You know, I got to take the trash out first. I was going to put it in the, usually I put it in my trunk and take it over there because the trash so far, all right, it's not, excuse me, it ain't so far, but I live way over there and the trash over there and that one look full, so I probably got to walk all the way over there, but uh, anyway, yeah, we about to leave right now, I'm going to take trash out of stuff, I'm going to figure out where I want to go first, uh, but yeah, once I get in the car, we're going to, we're going to, we're going to figure it out together, but uh, yeah. I see y'all. My dog was so sad when I was leaving. He wanted to come with me. But it's okay. He can't come everywhere. But yeah. Uh, look how full this trash is. Oh my God. I don't even know if y'all can see. Hold up. This is ridiculous. Now I'm about to have to walk to the whole other trash. That's wild. <clears throat> yeah, once I finally get to a dumpster that's not completely full, I'll get back. I'll tap back in with y'all. Oh yeah, so we back at my car, and I don't know if y'all can tell. It's really not major though, but like it's not level right here. It just keep right. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, folks. I checked the my hands as you yeah. But yeah, I checked the other side. And it's not like that, and it wasn't like this before. So like I said, it's nothing major, but I don't want it to become a problem where this whole thing start wanting to come off. So. I'm gonna just see if like they could put this down where it's supposed to be at or whatever. But yeah, like I said, it's not major or nothing like that. Um, so it's not number one on my list for sure. Ooh, the heat booming. It's cold, y'all. It's been freezing. What time? It's it's 34 degrees outside right now. Um, dang, I'm breaking out. Ooh, I'm back y'all up a little bit. Shoot, but uh, I decided, you know, walking. 15 ages to freaking the trash i just decided you know my health come first or whatever so obviously i'm gonna go get my uh heart machine and stuff first uh and then after that i'm gonna decide where i go from there depending on how long it take it take me like 30 minutes to get there so that's an hour of driving like there and back and then i don't know how long it's gonna take me while i'm in there so depending on that that's gonna decide what i do next my 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 guess is that I'm gonna go there, get my heart machine and stuff, then go see about my car, and then go to the grocery store. I also have to make another appointment, but they need this paper for me to do the appointment. So I just gotta go drop off this paperwork and then go to the store. But um, yeah, I'll tap back in with y'all once I get to the hospital. Well, to my cardiologist or whatever. Like I said, it's like a 30 minute drive, so yeah. I see how when we pull up there. Yeah. 
All right, y'all, so we had to stop at the gas station real quick. This is my first time, like, uh, since I first got my car, which was over a week ago. It was not this Monday that just passed. Today is uh, Wednesday, so not this Monday that just passed, but Monday last week. So I definitely miss the fact that my, got, my car is good on gas, for sure. But, um, like I said, we're going to go to the cardiologist real quick. Well, it's not going to be that quick, y'all. It's freaking 30 minutes away. And hopefully I don't hit no traffic. It's at 11.35 right now. So I look, you probably should have woke up a little earlier just to be sure on the way back I don't hit no traffic either. But we should be good. It's 11.35, it's like lunchtime. Um, but, uh, yeah, once I get there, I'll tie back in with y'all. All right, y'all, I know it's kind of dark, but it's because I'm in a parking garage. But I just got here. It actually didn't take me 30 minutes, so it's going to be 20 minutes to uh, get here. So, yeah, I'm about to go ahead and solve right now. Uh, once I get inside... See how things going, whether I'll pick up the uh the camera or not. But um yeah, let's uh let's get on in here and do what we gotta do some cause we got other stuff to do, man. We got other stuff to do. Peace. Alright y'all, I know it's kinda dark, but it's cause I'm in a parking garage, but I just got here. It actually didn't take me thirty minutes, so it's gonna be twenty minutes to uh get here. So yeah, I'm about to go ahead and solve right now. Uh once I get inside, see how things going, whether I'll pick up the uh the camera or not but um yeah let's uh let's get on in here and do what we gotta do some because we got other stuff to do man we got other stuff to do please all right y'all so i decided to just do a voiceover for this section i was trying to let y'all know that it was so quiet inside the doctor's office but i was trying to just let y'all know that y'all, i made it inside the office and everything but it was way 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 too quiet for me to be talking but I was filling out my paperwork. That's what I'm saying right now. I was filling out my paperwork to get ready for the thing. But that's about it, y'all. Alright. Alright, y'all. So I don't know if y'all heard everything that she said. But I got my little heart monitor. I got to wear it for, excuse me, two weeks. Uh, but it really was in and out. It's 12, 17 right now. Uh, yeah. Hopefully everything goes well with it, of course. Um, I'm just not getting to my car. But yeah, just like she said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to insert the clip of what she told me. I'm, I don't know if y'all can hear it or not. Obviously, I'm going to check when I'm um, editing or whatever. But yeah, two weeks with the heart monitor on. I got to leave it on at all times. If I feel any kind of way, symptoms or whatever of what's going on, just double tap it. I'll be good. So uh, I found out the results two weeks after, so in four weeks because I got to wait two weeks to wear it then two weeks for them to i gotta mail it back to them and then for them to i guess monitor it, get the results i gotta wait another two weeks so about four weeks i'll find out what exactly is going on hopefully it's nothing um hopefully it's a different issue but um like i said we'll see we'll see together um but yeah now that that is finished we're gonna go check on my car let me turn these guys back on. We're going to go check on my car, see what's going on with that little side piece. Like I said, it's not really, really, really not major, but we just going to make sure that it is nothing major. But, uh, yeah, I'll tap back in with y'all once I get to my next destination. All right, y'all, so we just got to the tire, not the tire place, the um auto shop where my car was fixed at. And we're going to just ask them pretty much to see the before picture just to make sure it ain't nothing that... I'm not trying to accuse them, you know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to more sure just make sure that it wasn't them. So, um, yeah, I'm going to uh, go in here and see what they say. Hopefully, it's nothing too serious. Well, it's not that serious, but hopefully, if they did it, they'll fix it and not try to, like, you know, like, give me pushback for it or anything like that. All right, so I'm back in the car. They said they're going to give me a call within, like, 30, 40 minutes when their tech guy gets back. Um, She did. She did. Uh, The pictures did look like they kind of messed it up a little bit, and she did. She was like, you know, we did fix this quarter panel, like, on this side and everything. So, excuse me. I guess I'm going to see when um the guy gets back to see. Like I said, it's nothing. It's really, really, really nothing major. I just didn't want it to progress, and the next thing you know, my whole silver thing on my car is hanging off. So, yeah, we're going to see. I might just run to the store right now because she said it's probably going to take like 30 or 40 minutes. So I'm just going to go to the store and get the stuff I need to get my wisdom teeth out tomorrow. And, um, yeah, then we're probably going to be coming back here. And I'll let y'all know what happened once we get back here. But let's go to 
whatever's closest food line kroger walmart literally whatever's closest to right here that's where i'm gonna go but uh yeah i'll catch y'all at the store hey man hey man we got walmart with it we got wally world oh god I had to make sure to look out for the cars. But uh, like I said, we just had to pick up a few things for me for when I uh, get my teeth pulled tomorrow, some soups. My girl is also sick, so I'm probably gonna grab her some medicine and some soup too. She wants some Panera soup. But um, yeah, it's sunny, but it's a little chilly, y'all. Uh, oh, thank you. We're hollering at each other. Let me find this soup, so let me get to the aisles I need, then I'm going to get back on here. I, uh, I, don't, I don't know this Walmart, so... Oh, this is... Look, see? 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 She told me, as soon as you walk in, you won't see it. And what I do... Oh, I don't see it. That's actually... Excuse me. Oh, problem. That's actually salsa and... Uh, and guacamole, but it's in a, a tin like this or whatever. Yeah, let me just... Focus and find it. I'm gonna tap back in with y'all. As y'all can see, man, we back in the car. Um, I come to the conclusion that I don't really like recording in stores, but it's mainly because these pimples got to go. But it's mainly because I feel awkward when people look at me while I'm recording. But anyway, hopefully one day I'll get over that. But uh, I'm out. I'm out of Walmart now. Uh, like I said, I, I just bought some protein and some soup. And I got my girl some uh, hauls because her throat, for her throat or whatever. And then, um, yeah, that's really it. So now, the people still haven't called me for my car yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go run to this other doctor that I got to see and give them this paper that they need or whatever. So I'm going to go do that. Hopefully, by the time I'm finished with that, they'll call me about my car. And hopefully, they can just fix it and, you know, not give me any back, back and forth about it or whatever. Um, I'm praying that they don't have to take it, like, for days or whatever, and they could just fix it right then and there. Like I said, it's really not, like, a small fix to me. I don't really know what it needs. To me, it looks like it needs some crazy glue, but I could be completely wrong. But like I said, I'm going to run over to this place, this, my other doctor, and um, give him this paperwork, and hopefully we'll see what happens after that, okay? We might be going home after that. We might be going back to the car shop after that. We're going we're gonna to see but um yeah y'all stay tuned i decided to stop right here by these conics boxes or whatever just take a few pictures y'all i'm trying to get into taking more pictures and getting comfortable in front of the camera so i did bring my little uh stand we're gonna try to take a few pictures i got a calm fit on you know i ain't i got sweats and stuff on but we're gonna try to take a few pictures and see how these work out like i said i got my little stand so let's see Hopefully, my shirt not clashing with the orange too much and the pictures come out all right. There's a lot of people out here, so like I just told y'all, I feel weird when people looking at me and stuff. And I don't take pictures, so we're going we gonna, to we gonna get out of this today. Uh, let me see if I can sit y'all up while I get this ready. right here obviously this is so i could attach my phone on here take a picture like that bow bow so yeah let's just get right into this you know what i'm saying let's make this quick this is i supposed to be on my way to the uh, to the freaking um doctor's office this is what i decided to do instead If these pictures come out nice, y'all gonna see them on my Instagram. Follow me on Instagram at Queen T. It's gonna be down in the uh, description below. All right, I'm gonna get back on here once I finish taking my pictures. All right, y'all. Yeah, so I'm leaving my other doctor's uh, not appointment, but I'm leaving my other doctor's office right now. They gave me a whole packet to fill out for my next appointment. But um, yeah, now I'm finna just go home. I guess. I mean, they haven't called me. Sorry, I'm never good. 
But uh, like I was saying, um, I'm about to just go home. They haven't called me about my car just yet. So instead of just wasting time, I'm only like seven minutes from home now. Like, so I might as well just go chill, unpack my car, you know, chill with my little baby doggy. I guess I can start editing this video too because this only going to be a daily vlog instead of the weekly like my last video but um yeah like i said hopefully everything go well man there's <laughs> a lot going on but we're figuring it out one day at a time but yeah, like i said i'm gonna see y'all once i get home if i get the call about my car that's where i'm gonna be at and who 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 else gonna be there y'all gonna be there with me you feel me so yeah let's go on head home see what the rest of the day is looking like uh, really don't really have any other plans. I think I did everything on my to-do list today. But, um, of course, things always pop up. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to just listen. If I'm up and moving, y'all up and moving with me. So, I'm going to catch y'all in the next clip. I don't know what it's going to be. But it's going to be something good. Y'all stay tuned. <laughs> But yeah, as y'all can see, I'm home now. My little clearly had to pee. He went outside. I'm looking for him inside. This man I ran out the door. He don't come back and knock. Not literally, but you know what I'm saying? Um, so yeah, we outside just walking right now. Once I finish walking him, I'm going to show y'all everything I got from Walmart. Then we're going to just chill. I might put the little heart monitor on now. Um, since I got to wear it for so for such a long time, I might as well just start. Uh, but yeah, we're going to see. Y'all just stay tuned. I'll pick up the camera once I get back inside. My little about to use the bathroom. Sniffing around in circles, you know what that means. But yeah, I'll be back. All right, man. We back in the hizzy. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we back in the house. Like I said, I'm about to show y'all what I got from Walmart. I don't want to play. I tell y'all, well, I can't. I'm playing with him after this. But um, let me grab the bag. I don't know why I left it over here. All right, y'all. So let's open this up. Oh, it was a heavy bag. I put everything in one bag, so this thing was heavy. Um, first thing we got is some jalapeno ketchup. Now, if you know me. I love spicy everything. So I got a small one just to see if I actually like it. But that's it right there. Some jalapeno ketchup. Bow. Everything else is what I was supposed to actually get though. Um, these are little Panera Bread soups that my girl wanted. So I got two flavors, but I got us both one of each of them. Broccoli cheddar and baked potato. Same thing, broccoli cheddar, baked potato. Um, I got some chicken noodle soup, some chicken and rice soup, and another chicken noodle soup. Then I got these protein shakes. Now, this is so that I could stay full like i don't know if it's gonna i don't know how my mouth gonna feel i don't know if i'm gonna be able to eat i don't know anything so i'm just being prepared so i got some protein shakes along with that 
Last thing I got was some hogs. Oh my girl, she said that she's just gonna take the third food that we already got here. She said she just wants some hogs, so I got her some of these. And that is my mini, oh wait, y'all can't see the, there you go. My mini Walmart haul. <laughs> but um, I guess, yeah, that's really it for right now, y'all. If I, um, I'm gonna go play with Milo a little bit, give him some love. But like I said, I just got back home and he running back and forth with his toy and keep throwing it at my feet so that I'll play with him. So yeah, we gonna tune in with y'all a little bit later. And um, yeah, that's it. All right, y'all, so we back. Uh, the last thing I recorded was all the way earlier for uh, what I got from Walmart or whatever. But now, as you can see, I look like I'm topless. I'm not. I put a, like a low thing on because what I'm about to do right now is apply my heart monitor. Um, I might just open up right now. Uh, the lady told me to, I just had to shower and everything. Um, so she told me not to put no lotion or anything like that. So if I look a little crusty, sorry, I literally didn't even want to touch the lotion just in case. So, um, yeah, like I said, this is the heart monitor. I got to wear 14 days. She said a full two weeks. So that's 14 days. Um, let's just open it up and see what's going on. Oh, Okay, this is the actual monitor itself. And this is like how I measure exactly where it goes. My heart on that side. Yeah, yeah, I pledge allegiance. <laughs> Sorry, yes, it does, it's over there. So that goes to my neckline, it goes right there. Um. So the first step is to take this out and attach the heart monitor to this. So it says to just place it right here in this blue thing and push it down until it turns green. That activates it. Okay, my love, you can't be a part of this. This man jumped right in my lap. Say what's up. Say what's up. Say what's up. Oh, now you want to talk. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let me just grab the directions to make extra. Oh, they got me. They got me. All right, step one. If I'm looking over this way when I'm doing it, it's because I could lower it now that I told y'all that I actually have clothes on. So. Let me just pull it up a little more. Okay, so, and don't do my tan lines. They've been there for a long time. They just won't go away. If y'all hear that, that's my little digging into the beanbag chair. He's crazy. Okay, step one. Shave if needed, then wash and dry area shown in the diagram. That's this part, I just got out of the shower. I don't grow chest hair. No offense to whoever does. Hey, it's natural. Cool. Remove the patch from the pouch. Patch from pouch. Uh, place sensor into the patch. Okay. They was using some big words, electro, electric, electrode. And which way do they run? Oh, duh, this way. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm shaking a little bit and I'm a little bit nervous. Um, I don't know. Like, putting a heart monitor on, it makes me nervous. Like, who wouldn't be nervous that you're gonna have to go through these steps? But they are just trying to rule out certain things. So, I get it. I'd rather them do it than to not do it and then something is wrong later. So, uh, it says to just press this onto here. As y'all can see where the little thingy's at. That's where it matches up at. It says to press this onto here. Make sure there's no gap. And make sure the green light. I heard that. I think it's on. Oh, yeah. The green light is on. Um, step two. Locate the patch placement template in this kit and follow its instructions for use. Okay. That is this right here. I might have to put this down a little bit more. Oh no, that should be good. <sighs> okay. So it says to take, remove plastic backing. So, okay. 
I gotta remove this back piece. Dang, how am I gonna? Okay, remove the black piece and apply the E patch on your chest using the template. Use as a guide as shown. Use a mirror for guidance, then remove the template. Okay, so how do I keep the template up? My girlfriend's on the phone. I will call her in here too. Oh! Oh, let me find out how to just sit on this thing. Okay. Okay. Wait, is that even? That's a little out. Oh. What is my little dope? Look at him. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, so. Put this right here. And take off this back piece. Oh, don't touch it. Take off the back piece. This is what the back of it looks like. Okay, remove the clear back and apply e patch to your chest using a template as a guide as shown. Use a mirror for guidance. Uh, press patch firmly against your skin. Remove top white paper. Okay, so let's. But I'm gonna look in the mirror, y'all, just to make extra sure. That looks about right. And this goes right here. Yeah. Right there. Bow. That wasn't that hard, y'all. Wasn't that hard at all. Let me just make sure it's firmly on there. Why my green light go off? It's supposed to stay off. So she did tell me, I, like I said, I don't know if I'm gonna be inserting a clip because I haven't looked at it yet, but if I did, I can skip a little ahead. But she did tell me that this patch might make me break out in hives, depending on how sensitive my skin is. And if it does, there's a number on there and they'll overnight me some hyperallergenic um, patches or whatever. If y'all get my girlfriend, I'm sorry. She on the phone with her family. So I'm pretty sure it's on there good, y'all. Just making extra sure. You know, I'm going I feel like so nervous, like my hand shaking a little bit. I don't know. I'm gonna clear that, I promise. And then remove the white paper. Around it. And we have successfully applied my heart monitor so i'm not gonna obviously count today as one full day because it is later in the day it is not even that late i keep the, look, look outside it's only like 7 30 or almost eight or some, somewhere around that time but um yeah i'll give y'all a little close-up of how it looks uh i'm gonna be very nervous to take this off my girl i think she got closer to the door or she's screaming or something but um, yeah, that's really it. Uh, I might be going to go play pool. I know that's crazy. That's the first thing I do when I'm about to go play pool. But I'm gonna close this video out right here just in case I don't go play. Uh, if I do, y'all gonna see it later in a little bit, like a little bit clips or whatever. But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and y'all stay tuned for the next one. I will be giving updates about my heart monitor changing it out stuff like that of course but yeah make sure you like comment subscribe i'll see y'all next one love y'all peace